The struggle wall was a mountain iron, not a footprint to be seen. And kingdom isolation, and looks like I'm queen. Let it go, let it go. I want to win the winter sky. Let it go, let it go. The perfect sky is gone. Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Mina from Japan. Let me briefly introduce myself. I'm an ordinary Japanese citizen who was born and brought up in Japan. And uh, as to my hobbies, I like uh, taking care of my dog, who is my best friend. Um, I like doing exercises, watching movies, and listening to music. So I'm an ordinary person, as I said. Well, uh, oh, just as a disclaimer, I'm not great at English, so in this video, I sometimes pause or uh, I may speak um, English, which is not proper, so you about please forgive me, okay? Thank you for your cooperation. Well, um, today, okay, I decided this is my first video in this channel, and what motivated me to start this channel and I have nothing to do. Well, um, I'm, well, to be honest with you, I'm so into about it that I have no friend except for my dog to say nothing of anyone who speaks English. But I can speak English and I can't stop interacting with the world. So that is a reason why I decided to start this channel. And today, um, I will, I'm going to talk about one of the things which was very surprising to me, sending your naked picture to your partner. Well, I'm a person who is very interested in knowing different cultures and adapting myself to different cultures when I travel to a different country. There was a time when I dated a Malgan man for the first time he was introduced by one of my friends who also dated an American man living in the southern part of the United States. And I was very excited about that because it was our first time for me to interact with um, Western people so profoundly. And after having talked over Skype for many times and exchanging text, a um, few months, few months later, he asked me to be his girlfriend, and I was so happy that I said yes. Happily, I was planning to go to see him, uh, going to the United States a few months later, but one day he asked me to send my naked picture to him. So, by the way, Mr. S. Oh, so in order to protect his privacy, I can. Mm, I'm going to call him Mr. S. So Mr. S um, had dated Western girls uh, and no people, no, pe no Asian people who have never lived in the United States, to be honest with you. And it seems that he has already accustomed to that. But for me, you know, I was like... What? You want some? You know, I thought... I, th I thought, what did you say, Mr. S? You are sexually harassing me? Or like that. Well, because um, none of, I, I had dated Japanese men, and none of whom asked me to you know, send my naked picture to them. Um, and I realized that it was a culture difference. And I was at the worst because um, I wanted to know him, and I wanted to know a different culture, but it was barely so difficult for me to accept. And then I consulted. I asked my friend who introduced Mr. S to me what to do. And she, being ashamed, confessed that she had already sent her naked pictures to her boyfriend because he asked her to do so. Well, um, at the beginning, she was surprised, just like me. But uh, in order to satisfy her boyfriend and please him, she was she was trying she was trying to 
like adjust herself to do that and she sent her you know, naked pictures to her boyfriend but for me I was barely uh, you know surprised and I was super ashamed um, so by the way uh, Mr. S and I um, had broken uh, broke up a few weeks later because I was you know so ashamed to send his pictures as much as I could and uh, later on he stopped texting me um, so anyway um, after that I interacted some uh, Western men via applications such as Tinder and after having talked and getting closer to each other um, some of them asked me to send them my naked pictures and I realized that it is a norm it is a norm for many Western people when it comes to dating um, they think uh, they are like part boyfriends or girlfriends however for me not only me but for many Japanese people it is very difficult to accept that because this is very new and this is a kind of strange thing for us uh, so uh, but I don't mean that I want to disrespect your uh, the Western culture but I want to you know respect because this is their norm and yes we have a norm which is very difficult for Western people to accept but yes there's no conclusion about this story but uh, I just wanted to sh share uh, one of the things which is very surprising to many Japanese people I suppose not only me but not many Japanese people because this is not a norm part of norm for us okay thank you for watching thank you for watching my videos and stay safe and see you guys in the next one bye bye